a very good evening and jai hind to all my dear children hoping that you all are hail and hearty i welcome you to the 10th module of english where we shall study an interesting story named the abraham prize it is a beautiful story that focuses on the fact that honesty is the best policy and an honest person always gets rewarded for this the story is written by david macrobie who is an australian writer of children's literature television and radio his first book was a collection of stories entitled talking tree and other stories published in 1976 so children let's begin with the starter given on page number 76 in your new broadway here you have to look at the two pictures and identify which of the students in the pictures is an honest student and which of them is perhaps cheating so you can easily find it out in the first picture the child is trying to cheat by peeping into the answer sheet of another child while in the second picture both the children are writing their own now there are few questions for you the first question is has any student ever tried to ask you for help in a test or an exam the second question is have you helped anyone in an exam when you were asked so these are the two questions you can take a pause and you can think about it now i am going to read out a short summary of the story so that you can understand well so the story starts with the teacher who made an announcement in the class that students will have a special examination in english on coming tuesday he told them that many years ago there was a boy at this school william abraham who became a doctor after completing his schooling now every year he gives prize to the student who gets the highest marks in the special english exam on the day of exam the teacher informed everyone that they have to answer 20 questions in an hour and reminded them not to cheat the next part begins with voi choi who picked up his pencil and started writing he easily finished first 15 questions just then a folded paper landed on his desk his classmate yanki was looking at him eagerly and asking the answer of a question Wai Chui denied and threw the note back. The teacher saw all this and took away Wai Chui's paper. He left the class with tears in his eyes. He rode slowly on his bicycle with his head down. He crashed into an old man. He apologized and helped him to get up. The old man asked him, "Why was he not in the school?" Wai Chui told him everything. The old man asked him, if he could prove his innocence just then wai choi noticed a pen in the old man's pocket an idea struck him he rode back to school immediately and explained to the teacher that he hadn't cheated as he always used a pencil to write his answers and he had already answered the question mentioned in the note he also requested the teacher to match the handwriting in the note with his own the teacher was convinced with his innocence and let him attempt the remaining paper in this way wai choi got the highest mark in the exam on school day when he walked up to receive his prize from dr ibrahim he was pleasantly surprised dr ibrahim was the same old man he had knocked down with his bicycle so children this was the story about wai choi and this story teaches us to be courageous and always speak the truth Now you can have a look on the mind map that is given in the form of flow chart for your better understanding and also I want you to write two pages as handwriting in your English to notebook that was all for today's class stay happy and stay